Hey everybody, welcome back. So today we're going to attempt, I say attempt, to work on um, basically our coal setup. I got beacons set up on all three of the coal patches and even the ramp over there so I know where they are a little easier on the map. Um, we do have to get piping uh, as well uh, worked on. So we're going to get water extractors. Uh, so you can see there, pretty simple recipe except there's some weird, you know, uh, plating there, there, some copper plating. You'll be like, what is that one? And then if we go to logistics and you'll see that copper plating is back again everywhere. And what that is, is I, th I think they call copper sheets or so. Uh, it's created in your, just your regular uh, constructor. If you go here, uh, yeah, copper sheets. And it requires two copper ingots and it gives you 10 sheets. And that's pretty simple. Uh, that's not hard to do or anything like that, but uh, I'd rather do it with another copper, I think, rather than just like tying in or whatever on that copper for now. So we do have, I think that's copper there. It's hard to tell with the light right now. Yeah, that looks like copper. So I think we're going to set up uh, a basic setup here after I kick this guy's butt. Yo, yo, this is mine. Let's do this. Let's do this. Ow, you actually got a hit off on me. I can't believe he got a hit on me. I was being too cocky, I guess. Boop. There you go. Um, so yeah, I will set up our, our basic miner here and then, uh, what, what is this anyways? In here, so this is a slow one, but it doesn't matter uh, for what we need here. This should be more than enough. Uh, so we'll set up a miner here and then we'll set up, uh, so this will be, if it's that one, it's just 30, right? And these are, were these 15? forget now were they 15 oh no they were 30 okay so this is pretty simple i it's it's sad because it's so simple that we can just you know go ahead and do it this way is this right yeah this is right okay so let's just put that there and then let's go ahead and put you to here and then we'll do copper and then what was the recipe for this again was it 20 i think yeah so we'll just do two of them just because might as well you might as well get as much as you can out of it, right? Kind of thing. So we'll just do that. Into that. And then, uh, yeah, we'll get two of these built here. Like so. Oops. We got, we're good? We're good. I think we're good. Hard to tell sometimes. Oh, yeah. It's like spread out further than I expect, but it's all good. It's messy. We're going to take all this down eventually anyways, because uh, we'll, we'll build a... A uh, better base in the the near future once we get a lot more concrete. But we're going to be using a lot of that concrete for a bit anyway. So uh, towards our new project here. So good, we can use this. There you go. Put you here and you here, and then I'll have you come over here. You here. You here. Perfect. And then we'll go ahead and we'll do our storage container. Do a merger or whatever over here. Um, merger is fifth place. There you go. Something like that. There you go. There you go. There you go. Pretty enough for us, right? There you go. So these will make our sheets. We don't need them right this second because we have a lot of other work to do. Uh, like getting all the other stuff hooked up, the mine, and getting them down below, blah, blah, blah. Getting a bunch of foundation down. But at least that'll help us. Uh, they might even be required for the coal generators. No, they're not. So that's kind of nice too. So yeah, we'll just let that produce. And then, uh, yeah, we'll head down. So let me go ahead and yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll meet you guys back at the thing because I don't want to waste your time by slowly getting my ass over there. It's actually not that far away. That's just our, our base there. But um, when you have your vehicle, it does help. You know, this is a lot faster than I expected. Though we were playing around the, the shoreline, things like that would have been annoying using this. Uh, but uh, coming in here, they have done some changes. So um, if we instead go for wide berth over here, this is where they did a major change here. This might have been actually the last update because I remember seeing some videos of them saying, oh, the, the nodes are at, as high as they used to be, right? The, the ore patches here. But uh, they, they changed things around. So they it kind of goes down. And I don't think there's a reason to it. Like, I don't, I don't know if there's anything hidden here. I don't think there's like a hidden cave or anything here. 
think it's just for for looks and you know adding more depth to the world and making it look really cool uh, I guess one thing you could do here, I know it sounds silly, is you have all the coal right here. You could put a pump here, and there you go. You got some water for your basic starting. So it could be an interesting way to do that. It's just, it is so cool, honestly. I just, I like it. But, uh, yeah, I don't think there's a huge, you know, meaning to this more than it just looks really cool. Adding more, you know, depth and variety to the universe, I think, is really what it's about. But, uh, yeah, it's pretty damn cool, honestly. I think it looks cool. Uh, so over here, there's a mama around here somewhere. There it is. Mama is really annoying. Mama will kick our butts and then kick it again. Best way to deal with mama is shove her off the cliff. I'm not kidding you to start with here. So what you do is you just basically keep pushing her off the cliff. And then she won't, as long as you're in that area, you should be fine for a bit. But uh, it's not going to be perfect, but it, she's, she's a big one. Like one shot, she probably can kill me with my three lazy health right now. Don't want to lose the, the tractor over the edge, obviously. I think that's a void too. So like if you fall, you're not getting your tractor back. Okay, one more nudge there we go so she should be hopefully dealt with for a bit if you leave the area she will come back as far as I know but uh, it should give us some peace for now so uh, let's pick up this if we can there we go so at least that we can get this done I don't have to worry about her um, so minor here we go so yeah, that's fine. We don't need to put it in a particular. Yeah. So there's the one. There's the two. Okay, let's. You know what? Let's because she'll spawn probably when we go too far here. Let's go ahead and like set this up in a sense that we don't have to worry about it. So we'll put this over here. Put it over on this side maybe or something. There you go. Something like that. Okay. And then, uh, yeah, so let's go ahead. So we're going to have to bring this all the way over here eventually. That's kind of the idea. But let's go ahead. And uh, I think the way to do this would be actually using these guys here. So let's put this on a six or something for now. But, uh, yeah, putting this and bringing this over here and then, you know, stacking these over time, I think it's going to be the key here. I like how it actually says vehicle in the way. Oh, you're... I was like, why were you fine and then not fine? It's because it literally rolled into the position over time. So it was fine and then it became not fine. Okay, that's so cool. Okay, so technically we probably don't need to deal with this for a bit anyways now for that spot. So that's the good news. So if Mama wants to come back and kick her ass, she can come back and kick her ass, really. So let's keep bringing this one over here. There you go. And you can fit under here, which is nice too. Okay, so yeah, let's go ahead and get more of you guys done here. So here's another miner. Let's we'll bring you over here somewhere. And then here's another one over here. There you go. And then we can hook you guys up. Hook you up over here. There you go. Yeah, there's Mama. Mama, you're not looking at me. She can be pretty grumpy at times. Okay, so let's go ahead and get another you hooked up over here. if that's close enough or not, but we'll see here in a minute. Oh, that's the autopilot stuff. No, I don't want to deal with that. We'll play with that eventually, probably, for fun, but... I think they might have... I don't know if they made it better. I, I'm gonna say they... I think they've worked on it recently. 
I won't say it's better. I'll just say they've worked on it because I don't know if it's better. And the reason I'm doing this in threes is because, well, I might as well get as much as I can over time through this. This is going to be our main power plant, right? So we're putting a little extra effort into bringing all three down. So that way it's done and over with for the future. So that's kind of how, why it's like, you know, putting all the extra in here. Now, something I wasn't smart enough is to remove the old beacons out of here. So we might have to break these just to get into the beacons. Oops, there's. Okay, so we'll take the beacon here and pick you up. We're going to have to remove this too because it's going to be derpy now. There you go. There you go. Hopefully, we're far enough from mom from this one, but she might be a pain in the ass. There we go. We should be fine now. Okay, and then we'll have to probably take this out. Because I don't know if it would snap back on there. Probably not. Okay, there you go. Perfect. Okay, now I don't know what the range on these are, but every so often you're going to have to, you know, obviously replace these down. It doesn't... You don't have to go crazy with them, right? So... So, we got... Two, three, four, I guess, right? So one, two, three, yeah. One, two, three, four. Hoping these are big enough. One, two, three, four. There we go. And then we're just going to keep uh, expanding these for a while. So hopefully I didn't do these too big. And there's no overclipping, but I don't know why it's giving me the warning of it. I'm just going to do it for everything. Okay, that's that's fine. Whatever. As long as there's not actually any overclipping, then I'm happy. Maybe it's worried it'll clip the sun. It's one of those big fat beans. Okay. You're random creatures, you know, you don't want to accidentally be walking into one and be like, oopsies. There we go. Perfect. So that's that's working out really nicely. Oh, one thing I'm not doing, and I should do it unless you want to walk all the way back here, is the power. Um, you don't want to have to deal with all the power everywhere. Probably gonna want to move it with you over time, so you could do pretty long stretches on this. But even if you have matched it up to this somewhat, then if you needed to pull power off this later on, it's not such a bad idea, really. But yeah, good idea to bring that with you, and then we don't that that's already done, self-sufficient in a sense, right? We can just ignore it and let it do its thing. Look at this thing; this thing is blocking out the light. Whee! Okay, so this is going to get tricky because I'm probably not going to be able to bring this in a down. So I might have to use those other ones and bring it all the way down. But it's like I need to bring it for further, though. I think I need to get a little closer at least. But, yeah, I have to decide how that's going to all work as time goes on here. So we go with you here. Go. Is it windy out or he just likes being silly? Well, the further I am, the sillier it gets. Look at this. <laughs> I love it. Okay.
Oh, it's like really like slightly too short. It's like it's like almost perfect, but not quite, you know? Okay, there you go. We're getting there. Yeah, the ramp is right over here, I think, right? This is all the rampage stuff here, I think. Yeah, somewhere over there. Yeah, over on that side. So this is where we were trying to bring it in-ish. I don't know how I want to do this yet, but it was either over this cliff somehow and then down, but like, I don't know how to do that. See, the issue is like, how do you bring it all the way you know, like down on a steep cliff is not an easy task. You can do the thing that can go all the way up and down, but I don't even think that does like, let's see here, wrong one, but oh, it does pretty steepness. It's possible. It wouldn't look right though. I'm just thinking it might be kind of dumb looking to be fair. Or you can go around and bring it with the thing and twist it around like a weirdo. I think I like that more. I don't know why. It's like way more effort, but I think I would like it more. Let's see here. Hoping that's going to reach because I want it closer to the edge. Either I'm not doing it. Oh, no, you're doing it. Oh, it's definitely too close. Okay. We'll just do it closer like this and then another one. Two, three, four. Yeah, I think I'm gonna, instead of trying to like get it down like through just like a steep, you know, cliff type thing, I think I'm gonna try to bring it down in a more silly, fun way. And I think that's just, it'd be a lot of fun, so. Max, is it really only like that low? I think I might have screwed up then. Yeah, you screwed up. I screwed up somewhere because it says max possible is five, but it should be 15, which means only one of the uh, three are connected correctly. Probably didn't actually hook up the other machines, right? Like an idiot? Yeah, that's why. Yeah, I never actually hooked these up. And here I was trying to never come back here, right? Not for a bit, but uh, I screwed up. There you go. Takes a little extra work. Okay, so it probably will take us uh, two episodes to, I mean, you can almost say three, you know, the, the exploring and, you know, getting a lay for the land, two, putting in the coal system, and three, getting the, the other part in, which that's fine to me, but it does, yeah, it t does take time and effort, and, you know, that's part of the game. I like it. I mean, I'm sure there's others who can do this way faster than I, but I'm having fun doing my way, so screw them. <laughs> Okay, so, I mean, you can almost see that one, right? Yeah, so you should be fine, too. Hope that's going to reach, because I've had some bad luck recently on reaching. There we go. Now, the power lines might be a bit more difficult. They do have... Um, steepness stuff and all that they get a little upset with so you got to be careful with them as you might upset them slightly over time okay so the tractor itself can't like the conveyor belt might be able to go down this way i mean that's pretty dangerous um but the tractor can't for sure so the tractor needs to go over here down the correct way which would be this right here basically I have a beacon somewhere right here. Oh, there it is, right there on the ground. Which this is, should be the way to bring the, the tractor down. But, uh, okay. But I'm thinking I could take probably some basic shortcuts with the, uh, the thing. I don't have to completely, you know, fall off. 
follow it all by the letter, I guess. So uh, here could probably work for the starting, maybe. One, two, three, four. I hope we're close enough. If not, that's fine. We'll we'll manage. Exactly good. We might run out of plates, so I think I have some on the tractor though. I did put some extra resources on there, so we're probably gonna be okay. I prefer it on this side, but at the same time, it's kind of getting. Maybe I'll just do it that way. Oh, I don't like that. I don't want to get it. Sometimes the lines go through, and it's like whatever. But I don't want to overdo it. We'll give it a second. We'll figure out what we're doing here. So let's do this again. Okay. So this is the part where things will get different, maybe even difficult. One, two, three, four. So this is the part where you'll die and fall to your death if you're not careful. But what we can do for a temporary safety uh, measure here is we can do literally this. Boom, boom. There you go. So my friend, can you go over here now? Because this should be perfect. Yeah, this should work. So we'll bring you over here as a start. There you go. One. Two, three, four. This is great. I like it. There you go. And then, yeah, this is where we're going to start going down, 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 down. You want to make sure you have room for your tractor, but the tractor is going to be more on the right here. So you should be just honestly pretty fine. I don't think you're going to have as much of a hassle here. Put them out fit. Yes, this would be perfect. Looking good. I like it. I think we're doing really good here. And then we can go and bring this guy. We, at this point, you could bring him right down to the beach here at this point, I think. That was cool and weird. Um, I wish these would have a thing underground. Yeah, look at how it floats there. Not a big deal, but it'd be nice if they could clip in the ground a bit deeper on purpose. Like a... Oh, except you had to have a problem with... Uh, they'd have to be some kind of smart system for that. Because the issue with that would be... Um... Weird glitch there. The issue with that would be, well, the ones up here would go too far down, right? That's probably why it doesn't originally like that. I don't know if it can sense that sun dirt or something or anyway, it's not a big deal. Um, let's get the uh, power line down here now. Beautiful. This might be too steep. We'll see. No, it seems like it's okay with it. I like it. Okay. A little glitchy there. I'm hoping it's just that one spot. Oh no, it's it's glitchy here too. I will, for the next episode, I'll reset the client. I don't know if that'll fix it or it could be just whatever visual bug, but I'll do the best I can, right? There's always something new in these kind of games that break on you. Poor developers, they work hard and it's like, no, we're going to be a jerk about it. Overlapping clearance. Is it because of the... Power, it might be the power line. I'm not sure. I can't tell. Try it again, though. Fudge sickle. Um, let's. Maybe it's just too. Too close or something. Like, let's just do it over here then, just as a bit. Two. Oh, I kind of glitched up on that. I guess it doesn't matter because of the way that is, but. There is none. Oh, I'm out of belt. I'm an idiot. 
I keep reading wrong, you know, messages there, but we we actually ran out of material. That's why it had nothing to do with the clearance. I realize I screwed up a bit on the one, but I don't think it matters because we're bringing it downwards. So, but uh, let's get our tractor down there, I guess. Let's, uh, I'll leave you for now. I guess it can still help us find the ramp, you know, this ramp part for now. So I'm assuming, I haven't tried this. This is the first I'm trying. There you go. I'm assuming I can get back up and down from that little corner there. So we should be pretty safe. This is a lot different than the old ramp. The other ramp was like, kind of like a, I feel like it zigzagged a few times and it was kind of a messy ramp to be fair. So uh, we're hoping that I actually have materials in this. I would say we have materials, my friends. Somebody was a little smart on preparing. I try. Um, okay. There we go. And then let's get our power line back up and running here. So let's see if we got our 15. Yes, we do. Perfect. Okay. And then basically now it's like the, the foundation city basically. So somewhere around here. Okay, you know what? I'm going to restart the game now. Oh, I think that worked. I like it. Which means this will probably work. If you don't open the crafting, I don't know if it's the crafting or the container, but the light should, oh, I just glitched up again. Oh yeah, there's lights working now on that. Oh, okay. Well, I guess that's just something we have to deal with. Was it because I went in there or was it because we were far away? Oh, it might've been because we were over here, yeah. Oh well, it is what it is, sorry guys. Not, not something I can fix, I don't think. We get like everything ultra, but like, is it because of DirectX 12? Is it because one of the settings are ultra? Is it because lighting was only high and not ultra? Is it because it is so high to begin with? You know what I mean? Yeah, screw it. Okay, we'll just have to get used to it. Um, okay, so now we're going to do foundation. Basically, what we need to do is start founding out, out here because we're going to we're going to build our uh, our power system out here. We're gonna build everything basically, right? So I'm thinking what we'll do is we'll have it slightly above the ground uh, like this. That way we can kind of bring it in and smoothen it over time over here. Oh, which one is this one? Um, I don't mind that one. It's just, I wanna use the other one actually for now. And then maybe eventually we can use the other, you know, we can replace it for roadways, but like I think it looks so cool that it should be more for the roadway. That makes sense. But yeah, we can go like this. And then are we on default mode? So you can do build mode and do the zoop, I think they call it. There you go. There you go, we got zoop mode on. Whee! This is the new feature, so I like it. Yeah, I used to, it was kind of annoying. I don't accidentally place extras and stuff like that. It wasn't bad because the building, at least in this game, was pretty fast, but you know, obviously zoot mode really changes the scale of things here for, for making building a little easier. So thank you devs for bringing in zoot mode. Thank you for everyone who probably hounded the poor devs for the last few years about bringing in the, the zoot mode and saying, we want zoot mode. Without you, we might've never gotten zoot mode. Okay, so let's put you on the bar. We'll just do seven, there you go, because I misclicked anyways. And I want to bring it back, there you go. I'm just gonna bring this over here. I'm just, might as well use up the land, right? Cool. I don't mind the bumps here. Like I don't need to put anything right there anyways, right away. It's just more like I'm trying to make a nice big, you know, kind of entrance to this and then we'll, we'll do our stuff so um this will be this will be great i'm thinking i'll go outwards i think i sometimes would go like left to right or something but i'm just gonna go like this way i think just out like this over time so we'll do it from over here though there you go 10 is your maximum it seems so that's great more than enough for us to be fair Ten. Oh, this is lovely. Ten. Ten. You know, concrete, you hold so much now. I thought I was going to have, like, not enough concrete. But then uh, 
you know, I, f I forgot that it's stacked more. I think it used to only hold like 200 concrete or something. And so it looked like we had like very little concrete so far, but I was just wrong basically <laughs> because of how they do the stacking of it now. So. Nope. Uh, there probably was a better button than doing that, but whatever. There you go. Well, I guess we can fill this in because we've already filled the rest in. Might as well do that as our, our, our thing here. You're gonna break fast enough, right? <laughs> it's like, whoopsies. Oh, you go. Now, I don't know how far, like I wanna get out there, but I guess I can clean it up, so. Oops, seven again, there we go. I can clean it up after. I guess it'll be short a bit, right? So I was like, yeah. I remember it can get dangerous over here. I don't know when that starts, but remember I told you part of the world is not like actually there. Uh, we could try doing it even now. And then you probably want to, you lose your tool if you're not careful. I don't care about you right now. I'll just take you, screw you, there you go. Um, you want to bring your tool out of your inventory because if you lose that, it'll suck. You know what? Just why don't we just make a second container instead of being a pain in the ass? There you go. Store all, and then store all. There you go. Weep. Oh, this is all okay. I know eventually it's the end of the world for you. Basically, I want to see where that starts. Or if it lasts a long time, I don't care. I'll just do it out here. Yeah. Okay, this is further than I expected. I like this. I don't know if they extended it or it's just a really good spot here, but I'm happy with this. Yeah, I'll turn around now, I think. Yeah, I can go out really far then. Okay, well, that's this is good news for us. Um, there's physics here, right? I'm making sure we can swim still. We're not falling, things like that. Because I was thinking if I put the water pumps on the outside and blah, 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 eventually I might fall through and it'll be a pain. Like, as far as I know, you can still build even if the physics are broken. I think you can still put a pump on and I think it might even think it's still in water because it's just using that layer. Like, it, it sees this layer here of the water, like this top layer, and it's a texture or whatever, and it sees that as literally just water, right? So... Oh, come on, come on. Oh, no. It's just slightly too high. Oh, we made it. Awesome. So I wanted to see if we can get up there, and, you know, that works out well, so. so we can go out there further. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. That would have sucked. <laughs> there we go. This is so easy to do. I like this. Best invention ever, devs. I want to kiss ya. Yeah. There we go. So it's a pretty big platform. I'm gonna go one more ten out, and then I'll I'll call that quits for you know the extension of this for now. And then we'll get this out, and then I'll probably do one more layer on my way back. Just why not? But yeah, I'm really happy we have more concrete than uh, I expected. So. I have a bunch in the truck still, like, I, I didn't think, you know, I was sh sure we would have needed insane amounts, so. There you go. That's it for that layer, and then, uh, yeah. There you go. And then, like I said, we have lots on us here. 
So I was thinking I might as well go all the way back. Fortunately, when you do this, you're going to have to... You have to grab it over here, right? So I don't know where the tip is here. So it's probably just best to just go for the walk. There you go. And there we have it. We'll bring it all the way back. I'm an idiot. Yes, I made it. Might be an idiot, but I made it. Okay. Oh crap. Uh, let's go in the water for safety. We might die. Oh. Darn it. I'm just not making it now. Oh, there you go. That was a disaster, but hey, we survived, so. It was worried we might come down and plop and die from it, so. <laughs> yeah, oh, because I opened the back, the lights won't work now, I noticed. No toggling the headlights on and off, yeah. So that's a bug, little... That was a bug, that's a bug. <laughs> well, I'm saying that's a bug, that's a bug. What the fudge. Okay, well, we, we finished the concreting anyways. Um, what we're gonna do is when we come back, we'll start working on the, the power system. Um, since I have to run all the way back anyways, I was gonna do it on the way back, but uh, I'll just run there. I'll, I'll bring enough inventory and I'll do a bunch of electric poles and I'll bring our power all the way there. Let's just check out how these are going. This is pretty slow, right? Because, um, not getting a lot, but yeah, it's, it's slowly getting there. So that should uh, get us a, a good start on our next episode. But uh, I'll grab enough materials to start the uh, the power poles and I'll bring them all the way there and hook them up to the grid. Uh, and then, yeah, we should be pretty good here. Those are 82, so I don't even think I have to worry about those even. I think we'll get the new power up and running by then. So anyways, my friends, thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe, comment, like, and we'll see wonderful people next time. Have a wonderful day. Goodbye.